Well, the LMU basketball team is on the rise and a transfer coming in is going to provide a big punch for them on the block. Lars Tiemann, seven feet tall. He's from Germany and he also loves to cook. I dropped by Lars's kitchen recently to talk a little basketball with him and also watch him make a delicious German dish. We're here with Lars Tiemann, center for the LMU men's basketball team. Not only are you a gifted basketball player, but you're also quite talented in the kitchen. So um, you're going to teach me how to make something today. Uh, you're of German descent, so what are we making? So we're making some traditional German food. We're making some Flammkuchen. One more um, time. Flammkuchen. Okay. So essentially like a, like a German pizza, oh, I would call it. Yeah. That's great. Uh, to FYI, Italian New Yorker, so I will be a very harsh critic of your pizza. Okay, okay. Uh, but I'm looking forward to this. First, we got some tortilla, whole wheat, of course. We need some cream cheese, some bacon, green onions, and then just salt and pepper. Oh, this and is an oven. pretty basic. Yeah, very basic. So what made you want to come to LMU? You had four years playing at Cal. Yeah. You graduated, you finished your undergrad there. Yeah. What was it about LMU that made you want to come here? I thought LMU was, you know, a great spot, first of all, because of the conference. And then LMU done well last year. LMU has come on the road and defeated Gonzaga for the first time since 1991. I just saw a huge potential of LMU, you know, being able to win a lot of games and making the tournament next year. So you come down here, you're part of this team now, and a lot of international flair. You have guys from Congo, Serbia, Serbia Georgia, Australia. Two yeah, yeah, two Australians. Do you guys teach each other about your cultures? It's pretty fun having a lot of international guys. You know, you just have like so many different characters. Yeah. Then the accents, uh, it's, it's just funny. Um, Do you guys teach each other all the bad words? Of course, <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> all right, so this goes in the oven. In the oven. 10 minutes at what temperature? 10 minutes, 450 degrees is what I put it at. But I'm probably going to check every couple minutes because I've burned those a couple <laughs> times. <laughs> OK, let's see. Let's see. I hope it's not burned. <laughs> Thank you. There it is. All right, there we have it. Cheers. Right, let's try it. Cheers. Oh, pretty good. Lars, I give it 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. I Two thumbs that. up. Thank you. Beautiful. Uh, it actually really was good. I didn't think so so much with the the ingredients when they came out, but it was delicious. And by the way, I was wearing high heels next to Lars, but the height difference, big dude.